So anyway, this is where we went. We are here and we went around this way, across here, around down along the water and then we took this red trail back and then we backtracked here again back to this cabin and back through here we were looking for that geocache up in there which we didn't find. Oh ah, well, Dave here it is. <laughs> On our way to Eau Gorge. Eau Claire Gorge I guess it is. Yeah that's it. Eau Claire Gorge. I don't know what do you figure this trail is a half mile? Mile? They never did really say on the thing, did they? Mm -mm. And another turn in the trail here. Okay, what are we supposed to be following? The white trail or the other trail? I think we're following the white trail. That's the long way. Yep. Oh, that's a little short way. And where's the peddler's cabin? Because we're halfway between that and the other one. We're supposed to be looking for the sunshine hanging somewhere. And yes, we're geocaching again. Thanks to my brother. Look what he got me into. Out here in the woods. Bear country. <laughs> okay, here's the cabin. And it's described in the geocaching pages there. So I'll pass this cabin and the next point, which I forget what it was. What was the next point? Between point 10 and 11, when this is number 11, but I'm not quite sure where uh, the next one is. Somewhere halfway between here and the next one. All right, I wonder if that's open, locked up. Bears in there. Oh, look at that. It's wide open. Sorry. You can see right in here. Yeah. Cabin out in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Now that's roughing it. <laughs> Wouldn't you say? I'd say. Is that the whole cabin? That's all of it. Wow. At least they got it all sealed. <coughs> Cabin's been nicely done. Holy moss. <laughs> now that's funny. Look at the roof. Covered in moss. Whole entire roof. That's it, just moss. Oh my. Ow, stinking mosquitoes. Oh, they are bad here. Okay, let's not let's not stop too long. Oh. Alright, we're supposed to look for a sunshine somewhere hanging in the middle here. Who knows where that would be. Okay, I guess we're about a, at least a half mile in already. And still haven't found a single geocache. And I think we just might have found uh, part of the river here. That's pretty sweet. All right, we're on the less beaten path here, which so far it looks pretty good, but who knows what we're going to come up to down the way here. Wow, people swimming back there. Portage here. This is point 10, so we never did find that other geocache anywhere. 
in the middle. Mm -hmm. Oh well. Guess we didn't find it. Okay, can't find that geocache anywhere. It uh, even even this little gadget isn't getting me anywhere as close to it. So it's out in the woods somewhere, and I'm not going that far into the woods. So we're going back to the truck. Okay, we're up the big hill. That's behind us there. And just a little bit more left, and I think we're back to the parking area. Get back in the truck and drive. Yay, look at that. There's my truck straight ahead. Gotta unlock my truck for the wife. And now we're back here again. At the truck. Just out here geocaching and that happened to drive by. Thought I'd catch that. Okay, I had to come back for the uh, come back to the truck. I needed to get a uh, pen, my camera, and a little gift to leave inside the little cache that we found. My brother he loaned me a machine here that takes us right to the caches and we found this one took us right here and we found a little book and we found a little box right there it was underneath this rock and here's my little trinket to leave behind special thing. That is. Let it fill up. There's room in there. We'll just leave one. Nothing in there that I want. A lot of kid stuff. Hey. All right. Well, and this one's going in there too. After the collection. Maybe somebody's car needs a, needs a cleaning out. Or needs a stinking out. All right, close her up. We'll put her back. See? Mm -hmm. Stupid horsefly buzzing around my head. Where are you? Okay, this has got to... Oh, we got to put the... Sign the book here yet. Okay. Add it to the books here. A and A. Okay, got the book signed and back in the little bottle, whatever it is, and back under the rock she goes where it was, hiding there. And this is the little handheld unit that my brother loaned me, made for kids, but it still works, got me here. Alright, 
have to make it back to my truck. We were up and down the road and I guess once you get close you gotta pretty much stop and start walking because uh, we kept on passing it. Turned around three times just to get here. Anyway, there's the beastie. <laughs>